HDR, High Dynamic Range Photography, is a technique that involves capturing multiple photos of the same scene at different exposure levels and then merging them together into a single image. This allows you to capture more detail in both the highlights and shadows of the scene than you could with a single photo. When we look at a scene with our eyes, our brain automatically adjusts to the different levels of brightness and contrast, allowing us to see all the details. However, cameras are not able to do this automatically, and as a result, photos often turn out either overexposed, too bright, or underexposed, too dark. HDR photography solves this problem by capturing multiple photos at different exposures and then combining them to create a final image that includes all the details of the scene. This technique is especially useful when photographing scenes with a high level of contrast, such as a bright sky and a dark foreground. To capture an HDR image, you will need a camera that has an exposure bracketing feature and can shoot in RAW format. Exposure bracketing is a feature that allows you to take multiple shots of the same scene at different exposures while shooting in RAW format gives you more control over the final image during post-processing. To get started with HDR photography, you'll need to set up your camera and tripod and choose your camera settings. Here are some guidelines to follow. Use a low ISO setting to minimize noise in the image. ISO 100 is a good starting point. Set your camera to aperture priority mode and choose an aperture that gives you the depth of field you want for the scene. Typically, you'll want to use a smaller aperture, higher F number, to get more of the scene in focus. Enable exposure bracketing in your camera settings. This will allow you to take multiple shots at different exposure levels. Set your camera to shoot in RAW format, as this will give you more control over the final image during post-processing. Use a remote shutter release or the self-timer function to trigger the shutter and minimize any camera shake. Once you have your shots, you can use software like Adobe Lightroom or Photoshop to merge them together into an HDR image. The software will analyze the different exposures and automatically adjust the image to create a final image with more detail in both the highlights and shadows. One important thing to keep in mind when creating HDR images is to avoid overdoing it. It's easy to get carried away with the post-processing and create an image that looks artificial or unrealistic. The key is to create an image that looks natural and captures the essence of the scene. HDR photography is a great technique to add to your photography arsenal, whether you're a professional photographer or just someone who enjoys taking photos. With a little practice, you'll be able to create stunning images that capture all the details of the scene and take your photography to the next level. HDR photography can be used in a wide variety of photography genres, but some types of photography tend to use it more frequently than others. Here are a few examples. Landscape photography. HDR photography is particularly useful in landscape photography, where scenes often have a high level of contrast between the bright sky and the dark foreground. By using HDR, you can capture more detail in both the highlights and shadows resulting in an image that better represents the scene as you saw it. Architectural photography. When photographing buildings or other structures, HDR can be used to capture all the details of the scene, from the intricate architectural details to the bright sky behind it. Interior photography. When photographing the inside of a building, HDR can be used to capture all the details of the scene, from the bright windows to the dark corners. Night photography. HDR photography can also be used in night photography to capture more detail in the shadows and highlights, resulting in a more balanced and detailed image. Product photography. In product photography, HDR can be used to capture all the details of the product, from the shiny surface to the intricate details. Overall, HDR photography can be used in any genre of photography where the scene has a high level of contrast between the highlights and shadows. It allows you to capture more detail in both the bright and dark areas of the image, resulting in a more balanced and realistic final image.